Welcome friends, welcome back to the channel. Yes, yes. Big up on yourself. Right now, I'm just interviewing a few of the international teachers, you know, Jamaican teachers. So this class is a second grade class. Now we're checking out the math area. You see what's happening right here, guys. Odd Todd, even Steven. Math, the foundation, the way of the world. Check out what is happening right here, guys. Look at this reading corner right here. What does that say? Reading is dreaming with open eyes. Oh my goodness. All right, so just checking out this second grade classroom. Now, friends, look what's happening over here. Jamaica, straight Jamaica, straight Jamaica, straight. Tell me what you see, guys. Tell me what you see. Wow. So this is one way that, you know, international teachers can do their culture corner when they come to work in a foreign country. You know, share your culture. All right? Now, in this class, I'm going to ask the second grade teacher a question. I'm going to ask her, give me a pro and a con of being an international teacher. Take it away. Okay, of course, uh, uh, it's a wonderful thing to be an international teacher. Here you have many resources. Your resources, they're readily available. Children have their own computers. They have all the different things like manipulatives and all to get the answer approach to all the different areas. As it relates to the content that is not, the, there is a challenge sometimes with your behavior, class management. However, if you get to know your children and have a relationship with them, let them know from the get-go your expectations of them, their expectations of you, and you keep doing your routines and your procedure, you will see that eventually you'll get it. And so once you have that, you can take it away in fine style. Remember, routine, procedure, on and on and on. Make sure they know your expectations. Yours of them, theirs of them. All right, thank you so much, thank you so much, thank you so much, guys. Please remember to like, share, subscribe, share, share, share with a friend. Positive vibrations, positive vibrations, positive vibrations, positive, 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 up on yourself. Hi, friends, it's me again. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. Now friends, we are checking out a Jamaican teacher <laughs> kindergarten class. Now, look at that guys. What is your mindset? Let's begin. All right, check out the focus wall over here guys. Tell me what you see. Learning is really happening right here guys. Learning is taking place. Look right there, guys. Today is a great day to learn something new. See all this technology? All right. Check this corner out. Beautiful class. Wow. Sight words in play. Look what is happening there, guys. All right. I'm going to ask this beautiful kindergarten teacher... Two questions. Okay, friends? Tell me a little about what you do on a daily basis as a kindergarten teacher. Well, as a kindergarten teacher, um, I teach math. I teach English. I teach Spanish. 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 I teach Thank you so much. Next question. Tell one difference and one similarity about being an international teacher as opposed to teaching in Jamaica. Well, as an international teacher, um, one similar similarity is that um, the children are not much different from back home, to be honest. Um, but I will teach basically the same thing like what we teach back home. The difference is that the environment is 
different. You'll find that there's more technology here than what we will have back home. The children are have their own computers, every single one of them. So um, it is easier to actually access things on the internet and teach them in a technological way than back home. Okay. And I think that's a that's a plus. That's a big plus. I agree. I agree. I agree. All right. Now we're going to check out some more of this classroom, guys. Look what is happening right here. Wow. Do you see the real deal? Yes, this is called the real McCoy. Guys, do you see how big this class is? It is very big. And every corner is occupied. Let's check out the math center, guys. Focus wall. Check out this area, guys. Wow, my favorite area of all. What's going on here, guys? Read, read, read some more. Read, read, read some. Reading is an adventure. This is where it begins. Look what is happening here, guys. You see how beautiful this reading corner is? I would love to be in this classroom. Wouldn't you guys? Beautiful. Learning is taking place right. Look here, guys. Kids can even hang out right here and read, read, and read some more. All right. Thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. And I'll be coming back with more positive vibrations. Positive vibrations, positive vibrations, positive vibrations. One love, big up on yourself.